Want to streamline your WAPI call management? This video unlocks the secret. Automate capturing transcripts and sending them in emails with make.com. Never miss a detail again. Check out the links in the description if you would like to get the resources for free to set this up. Tools we need to set this up are WAPI AI. It is a platform that allows you to easily build and deploy voice assistants without extensive coding knowledge. You can create a free account with WAPI AI. Make.com to automate the workflows. You can create a free account with Make. With the free account, you will get two free active scenarios and thousand free operations that is sufficient for creating this automation workflow. Virtual phone number from Vonage to make inbound calls. First, get a 10 digit long code phone number from Vonage you can create an account by going to dashboard.nexmo.com and after signing up, purchase the virtual phone number from Manage. Then you will need a Gmail account to send emails. First, we will set up the voice agent. Log in to WAPI AI to set up the AI customer support voice bot. To create a new voice assistant, click on the platform, then click on the assistants, then click on this create assistant. You can give any name you want to the assistant. Let me call this Midas King fast food and you can click on this blank template and then click on this create assistant. Here I set up the voice assistant and I will walk you through the different configuration steps. First we need to choose the model for our voice assistant. Click on this model tab. Here first message is what the agent is going to say when answering the call. Here I entered the greetings text. Then you need to provide the system prompt with all necessary details on how to handle customer phone call. You can get this prompt by downloading the resources as I mentioned earlier. Here I have entered the system prompt. Next click on this transcriber tab. Here we need to give the provider the model and the language. The provider I have selected DeepGram and the model I have selected Nova2 and we are using English language. Next click on this voice tab to select the voice that will be used to answer the customer call. We have several options to choose here in the provider. You can click this drop down box and then you see various options. I selected 11 labs and in the voice field, you can select this drop down box and select the voice that you like. Here I selected Sara. You can leave the rest of the fields at their default values. Once you are finished configuring the assistant, click on this publish button to save your changes. We also need to configure this advanced tab, but we need information from the make scenario to configure this. Hence, we will come back to this later. Our main intention is to set up a phone agent to take phone orders and email the transcript. For that, let us integrate the Vonage account to WAPI account. Click on this phone numbers. Here you can see two options. This one is by number, meaning you can directly buy phone number from WAPI. The other option is import, meaning you can import a phone number from outside. Click the import button. You can see we can import phone number from video or 1H. I made separate videos for importing phone number from Twilio and 1H. You can refer to the links in the description and watch those videos to import the phone number. Once you successfully import the phone, you can use it as an inbound or outbound. Inbound is to receive incoming calls and outbound is to make outgoing calls. Here we are going to use inbound as we are setting up WAPI agent to take phone orders from the customer. Here you can attach the assistant we created earlier to this inbound phone number. Let me click this drop down and then select this Midas King fast food. You can see now that this number is attached to this assistant. Once this is done, we can start making calls to the inbound number and the phone agent will handle our call and take the food order. Next, we need to set up the make automation. We are going to build a scenario as it is a very simple automation with just two modules. Log into your make account and click on this create a new scenario button. First module we are going to create is the webhook module. So search for webhook here. I typed in webhook, select this webhooks and then select this custom webhook. This webhook acts as 
a listener for external events or signals from wapi and when it receives the signal it triggers the execution of make automation workflow if this is the first time you are creating a webhook module you will see create a webhook option here or we can click on this add button to create a new one let me click on this add button you can give any name to the webhook i'm just calling it wapi underscore tutorial then click on this save button now click on this copy address to clipboard and let us go back to the wapi dashboard and let us go to our wapi assistant this is our wapi assistant mid asking fast food let us click on this advanced tab scroll down until you see server url this is the server url field and paste the webhook address here i pasted it here then click this publish button to save your changes now let us go back to the make scenario then click this okay button and click on this save button to save your scenario at this point run the webhook module once so that all fields from the webhook module are available to the gmail module that we will add later in order to run it right click on the module and select run this module only now while it is waiting for the data call the inbound number that you already set up and finish the call let me call the number from my phone welcome to midas king fast food how can i help you today i want to order french fries great choice we have regular fries large fries and seasoned fries with various dipping sauces how many orders of fries would you like to order today just regular fries that's all thank you bye you're welcome your order for regular fries has been noted thank you for choosing midas king have a great day the call is finished and you can see the module letters turned into green that means this module got executed successfully now we can examine this output and here we have all the fields available for us that can be used in the subsequent module close this out next we will add the gmail module that sends the email with transcript click on the plus button here and search for gmail here then select this send an email if you are using make gmail module for the first time refer to my video with the title make automation connect gmail module with custom oauth client so that you can use gmail to send you emails then here you may see create a new connection once you click on that you will see this dialog box pop up you can give the connection any name you want then click on this sign in with google and then follow all the prompts after the connection is successful you will see this dialog box now you can configure the remaining fields in the gmail module click on this add a recipient here you specify the email address that receives the email with the transcript here i pasted my email address then type in the subject line that you would like to have here i typed in wapi call transcript click on this content field and then select transcript field from the webhook module now click the okay button here again click on this save button to save your scenario now we will set up a filter that checks for end of call report and triggers the email module only if the check is successful right click on this line and then select set up a filter you can give it any label name you want i typed in end of call report and we would like to check the field message type that contains the value of the type of the report and in the text operators equal to field paste this end of call report text and click on this okay button and again save your scenario by clicking this save button now our scenario is ready for testing to test the scenario click on this run once button while it is waiting for the data let us call our inbound phone number welcome to midas king fast food how can i help you today i want to order french fries great choice would you like regular fries large fries or seasoned fries and would you like any dipping sauces with that just regular fries anything else you'd like to add to your order and a bottle of water got it so that's an order of regular fries and a bottle of water your total comes to $3.50 will you be paying with cash or card on pickup pickup with cash perfect your total is $3.50 your order will be ready for pickup in approximately 10 minutes thank you for choosing midas bye the call is finished and you can see the green letters here the scenario ran successfully we can also examine this output from each module let us check the inbox and see whether we received email with the transcript here you can see the email let me click on this and here you can see the transcript so congratulations you built a wapi voice agent and make workflow that captures and emails you the wapi call transcript bye until next video